Hi everyone, this is Marissa from Azoic, and today we're going to go over enhanced integration. So enhanced integration allows you to identify specific parts of your site, such as where the content is, the logo, etc. And that helps in the setup of specific apps that require enhanced integration. If you want to know if an app needs enhanced integration, just look under the app name and it'll be in blue and say enhanced. Or you can filter by the integration type. So now I'm going to go into the mobile friendly app, which requires enhanced integration. If I try to install the app now, it will tell me I need to do enhanced integration. So I'll just go a little bit lower to this button that says Start Azoic Enhanced Integration. It can take a few seconds for your site to load. And when you get to this page, you can see it's blank, but has sample text for the content, sidebar, the logo. So I'm going to start with the logo. Click on Find My Logo on My Site. Once you find the logo and highlight it, click on it and you can click use this element. And when you get back to this page, you can see that your logo is in the logo area. If you realize that you clicked on the wrong part of the site, you can click options and delete the logo and then go back in and find the correct logo. So next I'm going to do the main website content. And as you highlight over different areas, you'll be able to get different containers. Make sure that you get the full container for your main content and not just a header like this. Once you get here, you can also go into the container and see some of the other options. And when you click on them, it'll show you the area that will now be selected. And then click Use This Element. The only aspects that you need to identify are the menu, the logo, and the main content. But you can absolutely add the other areas. It's certainly helpful, such as the sidebar, the footer, and once you've completed that, you can go ahead and click Complete Integration. And then you'll get to this page, which tells you that you're done. You can close the window, and now you'll be able to install the app. Well, that's all for today. If you have any questions, you can always email us at support at Thanks. See you next time.